Good evening friends, so here I am going to show you the fundamental analysis of one of the leading telecommunication company in India. The company name is Airtel. You can see the company is having lot of branches in Africa, Kenya, Zimbabwe, Nigeria <coughs> and also you can see companies having some branches in Asia, India, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka. So when you click on an India site, you will see what kind of services companies doing, prepaid, postpaid, postpaid DTH, broadband. Airtel, Black, Black, different experience companies having entertainment, lifestyle, gaming, uh, buy prepaid, postpaid, broadband, Airtel, Airtel payment bank, international roaming, office internet, lot of things companies doing, and India is one of the best and biggest uh, company in India. So let's more uh, financial data of the company. So you can see here the price companies. Uh, this is a today's price. You can see the five-year price is showing that company is giving a almost uh, decent uh, return for to, for the particular investor. Okay. So you can see here the about the company's delivery is 30, 35, 40 percent, and uh, you can see this is the monthly basis data. Company is paying dividend consistently. Okay, company. Uh, uh, okay, now you can go into the technical. Check the indicator. Check with indicator right now. It's overbought. Check with your technical advisor. Now you can see the company's price is six hundred ninety-four. Okay. Now you will think that how this particular company is having uh, this much uh, this much uh, market cap even after having low price. 694 rupees market cap is 3,81,000 wow EPS is 2.06 P is 336 very very high P okay when you check the standalone the same scenario companies no not having so this kind of company I'm telling this is a kind of fat or maybe average kind of company which which is not having any kind of uh, detail about the P and EPS now you can <coughs> Check the quarterly result of the company. Every quarter, company is increasing their sales. Okay, now you can see twenty thousand crore to twenty-three thousand crore to twenty-six thousand crore. Okay, this way company is growing there. Or else, company's EBITDA is also growing. Expenditure again, if you see expenditure is very low. So after trading, company is forty-fifty percent margin. Company is in, in uh, doing. Depreciation seven thousand seven hundred. Interest paying company four thousand. <coughs> After pay interest, company is still creating uh, some negative return. Why is it? Because of some exceptional item. Exceptional item: thirty thousand, ten thousand, six thousand, eleven thousand. Right now, company reduced their exceptional item. It's becoming thirty thousand. Now, company is having, after reducing depreciation and interest, company is still creating the uh, particular uh, return. Right now, twelve hundred eighty-one crore. Okay, it is positive since since last one and two quarters. So something a positive for the company. Okay, now you can see the company is basically creating the overall consolidated two hundred eighty three crore. Okay, after minority minor minority interest minus, company is creating this much amount after paying the taxes. Now, and then let, let's see company's uh, uh, annual data. So you can see company's annual data right now showing negative, negative because of that exceptional item, as you can see on the screen. Because of exceptional item, forty thousand crore, fifteen thousand crore. Okay, but might be this is a one and two year gap, but company can may may uh, recover from here. Okay, now let's check the ratio. Company is having everything in negative return on equity, let's check frequency, uh, uh, efficiency. Company's book value is decreasing, not a good sign for the company. And and working capital is very very good. Company is getting money in advance before uh, providing the particular product. Now you can check here the financial data. The company's chart is showing basically this is the balance sheet chart, profit and loss statement chart. Company is making profit. Balance sheet company is growing there, but balance sheet cash and flow claim company is increasing their cash. Now check the share 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 holding fund. This is the one of the negative sign, and that's why the particular company's price is basically trailing at 700 rupees, but it's still company is creating 3 lakhs crore market cap. This is the reason company is having high high equity capital of 2746 uh, crore equity capital, very very high. Okay. One thing and another thing is that. 
company company is having uh, reserve is also decreasing because of that particular exceptional item which you saw that time okay now you can see current liabilities company have ultimate current liabilities very very negative sign for the company company is having current liabilities of 1 lakh 33000 crore okay now you can see the uh, non current liabilities sorry non current liabilities is having companies having uh, 1 lakh 33 but current liabilities having 1 lakh uh, 11000 both are very very high now you can see the overall <coughs> non current asset is 2 lakh 71000 which is against the non current liabilities very very good when you click on you can see company increasing their long term investment fixed asset they are increasing loan in advance basically increasing very very good sign for the uh, 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 part of non current asset current asset company short term investment is 4000 crore inventory 266 crore sundry debtor is 3600 uh, crore cash and bank 13000 very very good sign companies maintaining good cash okay um, oh, after that just check profit and loss creative companies creating lot of sales but because of this exceptional item companies is having some negative turn now cash and flow companies creating lot of cash from the particular system now you can see uh, overall shareholder pattern right now companies promoter is selling their stake but after some time companies increasing their promoter increasing their stake here 56 Point two three two fifty five point. Sorry, it is also reducing my mistake. Fifty six point two three two fifty five point eight six is the reducing. FIA fully interested in this company. DIA also increasing their stake, and non institution is already in, uh, invested in this company. Now check who is the owner of this company. Company's owner is Bharti Airtel. Foreign, you can see. Company is having these kind of company like Pastel Limited, India Continent, and Vridian Limited, public holding some company like LIC, SBI, HDFC, all these kind of top uh, mutual fund. Singapore government of Singapore is also holding. Very very good sign. This is actually the name of the Sunil Bharti Mittal. You can see mutual fund is holding this company. Edge report you can see future and option. Okay, scan and deals. Okay. so hope this video help you to understand the uh, overall uh, quality of the company bharti airtel uh, okay so thank you have a